Hi friends, this is Gastro Guru, aka Prashant Shukla, and welcome to Gastro Guru Kitchen. Today we're going to make a quick and easy, simple yet delicious dish, pico de gallo. Pico de gallo is fresh salsa made with tomatoes, onions, lemon juice, fresh cilantro, salt. And you know, we enjoy this with chips or with, you know, quesadillas, or the Mexican dishes. So let's get started. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna chop up one onion and cut it into small pieces. We'll peel the onion. See, here we go. Make sure the onion pieces are not large. So I'm going to chop this, and then what we'll do is chop it further. Now we're going to, you know, roughly fine chop it so that the onion pieces are not too large. That's the last thing you want, is huge chunks of onion in your pico de gallo. Alright. Alright, so we're going to transfer the chopped onion into a bowl. Okay, I'm gonna make sure that I get a really little piece. There you go. So now we got the onion chopped. Next thing what we're gonna do is we're gonna chop three tomatoes. Now what I'm gonna do is you know, Cut it to half, and then what I want to do is like take out, you know, the seeds because the seeds and the juice is going to make it very liquidy, and the salsa is going to become soggy. And that's what we don't want. We want the salsa to be tasty and crispy, not soggy. Take out the seeds and the mem membrane and throw them away. All right, so our three tomatoes you know, are chopped, and we're going to add that to the bowl on top of the one onion that we chopped. Next thing what we're gonna do is we're gonna chop up a jalapeno pepper and then add that to the bowl to the Kodakaya salsa. I'm gonna chop this in half and then I'm gonna remove the you know the membrane and the seeds because that's where it gets really hot and spicy and we don't want Something too overwhelming. And we'll do that with the other half also. Take off the membrane or most of it and the seeds. And now we're going to chop it into fine pieces. Okay, 
that's going to go in here. And we are going to do the same thing with the other half of the jalapeno pepper. I like my sal salsa, any salsa, spicy, but we don't want it to be too spicy. And that's the reason we took off the, the seeds in the membrane. Okay. Fine chop. Add that to the ball. Okay. Now, one last thing that we're going to chop is cilantro, fresh cilantro, because you know this is a very important ingredient in making the good pico de gallo salsa. This is also known as fresca sal salsa because it's freshly made. All right, so I'm gonna give it a fine chop. on top too. Look at that. How beautiful it's already looking. Um, scoop up the rest of the cilantro. There you go. It's all good. Now we'll put the knife away. You don't need the knife anymore. And then Now is add salt, and you know, we can adjust it later. But this is about a little over a teaspoon, a little less than a tablespoon. And then I have lime juice from half a lime, fresh lime that I squeezed earlier. So I'm going to pour that on top. Okay. Then we are going to gently mix everything so that onion at the bottom comes on top and it gets mixed with the tomatoes, the lemon juice, then you have your fresh cilantro and salt. So we're going to mix it up nicely and then what we're going to do is serve this delicious Pico de gallo salsa with corn tortilla chips. And you know, we'll do that presentation later as to how we are going to enjoy this. All right. Looks good to me. So, folks, here it is Pico de gallo salsa. Freshly made for you to be enjoyed with tortilla chips. See how delicious and gorgeous that looks, and it's not difficult to make at all. It doesn't take too long. So please watch my recipe, my video on YouTube, on my cooking channel, Gastro Guru, and do like, share, and subscribe. Thank you, and bon appetit.